Hello everyone, welcome back with Mufasu Cat. Today we are going to learn how to create a simple portrait with KiCad software. Okay, first in here I will hide cut. You can click this icon cut. The next we can create a horizontal line and we can set for length into 4000. You can click in drawings so it will be quad line with length 4000. You can use scroll mouse to zoom in and zoom out and you can press scroll mouse to use pen. The next we can correct for vertical lines with length I will set into 5000 and then I will click at this point. Now in here I will use a copy command we copy this line objects use this tool. Okay, click from this point we can copy into this point. Keep original. The next I will copy this line objects from this point move to the top and then keep original okay now in here we can use uh, vertical again and I will create length into minus 2000 use these tools this 10 and I will set this 10 2000 so you can click from this point okay and then you can click from intersection in here we create again for uh, vertical uh, horizontal and then for length we can set into 2000 the next we can use a distance we can click from this point to the bottom here so it will be quite line in here. the next uh, we can use a uh, offset command we can click uh, offset tools in here offset and now I will use uh, this option and also with uh, this meter join for this 10 we can set into 150 and you can click inside here we create again with this 10 75 click uh, inside and outside okay now we can select a middle line and you can press delete button and in here I will use this tool okay you can use the divide you can divide this line from this point divide again in here and the next this line object from this point and also at this point now you can select uh, this uh, all lines don't forget to press shift button to select multiple and you can press the left button we divide again in uh, this uh, line object okay first at this point you can click the lines and click in here this line at this point and this line object in at this point select uh, this all lines and you can press delete button okay we create uh, this uh, simple sketch the next uh, we can create door okay you can use uh, this uh, vertical lines and i will set length into 1000 click at this point in here we can use uh, offset command I will offset with the uh, offset distance 30 you can click at the drag here the next I will correct arch from uh, center point click at this point move to the top and now you can click at this point and then you can connect into here okay we can create line okay from a two point I will click from this point in the width to connect press escape button to close we can create a vertical line I will set in here in 2 minutes 150 click on this point next we can create horizontal line minus 40 from this point and now we can use a copy tools to copy these objects from this point into here okay and then we copy this line object from this point into here keep original okay the next we select uh, these lines and these capitals from this point i will move into this point okay now we can convert this object into block you can select uh, this all door entities and the next you can click block menu click red block from selections in here we can 
click for base point in here. The next for block name, I will set into door. You can click OK. <coughs> so it will be automatically create your block. You can see in property editor, and this uh, selection is block reference. I will create a new layer list in here, and we can set to block. I will change color like into another color, this dark yellow. Okay. And then you can select uh, this block, click property editor, and change layer into this color. So it will be automatically changed into layer one, layer block. Okay. Now in here we can move this object, move copy, you can click this tool, you can move from this point to here. You can set keep original. The next I will rotate this block. This this tool rotation from this point, and then I will set angle into 90 degree. Delete original, okay, and then we can move again from this point. We can move into this point and click uh, delete original. Okay. Now in here we can use the divide again. Okay, you can click here divide tools. I will divide this line. From this point one, and also in here, connect this line object. Okay, divide again at this point. Don't forget to select the object and select a point to divide. Click this line object, click in here, click this line, and you can click at this point. Okay, the next I will select a this line object, and you can press delete button. And now I will hide uh, this block. You can click this tool to hide. And in here we can use a line command <coughs> to connect between this line from this point into here. Okay, uh, don't forget first we need to show this. You can select uh, this layer zero and then we can <coughs> create line. From this point into here, okay. Press exit button to close the next in here. Click at this point and the last at this point. Now you can show or block. Click here, you can see the next. I will insert hatch into this wall. You can use this tool hatch. Click in here to setting hatch. We can set into NC31 and scale 17. <coughs> you can click OK. The next we can select uh, this line. We can select one by one. <coughs> okay, in the top here. Next in uh, this line object. <laughs> and now to apply you can right click so it will be automatic apply to change the color you can select this uh, hedge and go to property editor in here we can change color into this color orange you can click here to see it will be changed to orange the next we can show for black layer okay now the next I will insert a text. To insert text you can use this tool text and I will set in here into room 1 for example. Click OK and we can part in here for room 1 to change again. Okay, so to change uh, text you can select the text in here and you can go to properties editor. In here you can change style in here. For default, we can use scale 1. The next for text hex in here, I will set into 150. And for text uh, in here, we can set into room 2. And for the text, we can set into room 3. Okay. Now, how to apply dimension? You can go to edit and click drawing preference. Click at this dimension settings. We can set for scale factor into 50. 
and you can click apply and okay the next you can use these tools like we can set into horizontal dimension you can click from this point click again into here and then move to the bottom here okay we set again from this point and in here we can use snap to point or you can click in here snap and use this middle manual click from this point into here so it will be a plus in the middle and then you can click at this point right again from this point into this point okay the next in here to the top okay you can select this uh, dimension click from this point hold and you can move to the top here click again we can create for vertical dimension click from this point into this point okay the next in the left here from this point in here we can use snap again this is a middle manual from this point okay moving to here the next from this point into corner point click in here now finally from this corner point into corner point in here uh, sorry into corner point at this point and you can click okay we already create this uh, simple floor plan with uh, keycard software and if you have any question about this uh, tutorial, you can comment below this video.